Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super duper excited. We're taking a look at a motorhome, yes, but this motorhome is the first one that has the all new Ford V8 7.3 liter engine. This is a 2020 Integra Coach Vision Model 29S. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna go over the three things we love about this motorhome and the three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel that gives you that true and biased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I am super excited to be showing you this Integra Coach Vision, but more excited about what's it's powered with, with the new engine. But before we begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hi everyone. Hey Andrea, what's going on? It's hot. It's hot, girlfriend, you I'm, know it. I, I'm standing in the sun, guys, and we are by the highway, so I apologize if there's any noise. Yeah, but the highway's actually not that bad. Let's get started. Right here, show, right here, Andrea. Show what's going on. Uh-oh. This has the new Ford F53 chassis. It's the 7.3 liter V8 Ford engine. It has 350 horsepower, Andrea. Also 460 foot pounds of torque wow now here's the deal um they, they went away from the ford v10 engine listen folks nothing's wrong with the ford v10 engine there's pros and cons to both of them just like there's pros and cons to every rv out there so don't buy this one because it has the v8 or don't not buy that one because it has the v10 trust me y'all they're they're both listen i guarantee you nobody can tell the difference so let's begin Model is 29S, but the actual tip to tip length is 31 feet 4 inches. This is the 2020 Tiger Coach Vision. I love this floor plan because it's very state and national park friendly, very popular floor plan. And um, we have this as a 2020. It wouldn't surprise me if it's a 2021 um, because the Ford V8 engine. I'm not sure. Coming down the side here, you have your mirrors on the side. The camera is integrated in the mirrors on your left side right side in reverse again Ford V8 engine check out these tires Dre these are the good years 245-70 R 19.5s coming down the side here because it is an Integra coach you have a two-year warranty three-year structural nice huge power awning frameless windows let's take a look at this awning when it's all the way out Oh my God, Andrea, it cooled it down like 10 degrees. I like the pattern. I love how it goes almost the whole length of the motorhome. Oh my God, it's such a big awning. Nice oh, power yeah, awning with LED lights. Here. Check out these nice fiberglass stainless and latch doors. Love I that. love it. Because it's an Integra coach, you have the Easy Drive Elite system right there. We have an external television with DVD player, sound bar, and everything. Check oh. this out. 16.5 pound propane tank or gallon. Um, I love the battery on the slide out tray. And Andrea. Yes. We will have all the rest of the specifications about this motorhome down in the description below. Also right here. Bing. So everybody who's watching on TV can see the specs. Uh -oh. More storage right there. Very nice. I love how Integra puts these doors on their entry level. Oh, me too. And then check this out. Uh, yay! Yeah! Outdoor fridge! Look at this. Good. That's a great size. Great size fridge, sink that's plumbed through. Uh, cabinets right here. And then I did see a propane quick connect over there for an exterior grill. Nice. I love it. I love it. And I love how these are slam latch as well. Coming around the back, look at that. You got a nice bumper for your stinky slinky. I love that. You got your backup camera right there. 5,000 pound hitch in this motorhome can tow 5,000 pounds. And Andrea, yes. it has a one piece fiberglass roof. Let's go up there and take a look. Oh yeah. my goodness. Here we go now. Hold on. Oh, spider web. Okie dokie, up here on the roof, you can see it's a nice one piece fiberglass roof. You have not one, 
but two air conditioning units. I love that. Right up there is your King Air digital antenna. There's your dealership. And right there, it is prepped for solar on the roof. Hold on. Here we go now. Andrea. Oh my goodness. There. I bet. Great. Oh, and if you haven't already, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. What do RV salesman's gonna take his fat ass up on the roof on a hundred degree day to show you what features the roof has to offer? Nobody. Nobody. Right here is your fuel fill up. Still an 80 gallon fuel tank. Oh Ooh, my God. I love it. I love that. Great wet bay. Very nice. Eat on their entry level. I love that. Watch your head there. I see it. Nice. Right there, we got a little bit more storage. Mm -hmm. Coming down the side. More storage, more storage. Actually, this is our... Oh, that's your black tank. Yeah. Oh. Right there is your water heater. More uh, storage. You got your water, water heater, heater right, right there. there. And our generator, what do we got? Cummins Onan 5500. Gasoline generator. Nice. Oh, a little bit of something right here. A little bit more storage. Okay, great. Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great. Let's check out the inside. <laughs> it's going to break a sweat. It's hot. I know it's hot. Who are you telling? Check out the inside. What's the cargo carrying capacity? Uh, 1,392 pounds. Yes, okay. Great. All right. All right. Check it out, Andrea. Yes. This is what the motorhome's like when you're driving down the road. Okay. I have plenty of walkway here to get to the bathroom. Oh, yeah. And here's the master bedroom. Now, Very Andrea, nice. Yes. While you're putting the slide outs out, I have a huge favor to ask everybody. If you could, please make sure you, you um let us know down in the comments below. Let us know the three things you like about this motorhome and the three things you don't like about this motorhome. The more people who comment and smash that thumbs up button, the more people YouTube likes to promote our video to. And we appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Andrea. Yes. This is our very first look at the new V8. Yes, I'm excited. So it's not just the engine. It's the console area. Look oh, at this. Oh, wow. Look at oh this. Oh, my god. New steering wheel. New this, new that. Look, look it's all new. There. Look. Look at the dashboard. Look, yeah, the dash is new. Look oh, at this. Andrea. I know. I, I can't wait to yep, see yep. it. All right. Turn All right, the chair around. On. Look, everybody knows if you've been watching our show, just, just turn it. it. It's already unlocked. It's not. Oh, is it locked? Hold on. Oh, you can't go that. Oh, you can. Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay. Easy access. <gasps> everybody knows Integra, we hated their dashboards. Look at that. They listen. Yay! Good job, Integra. I love that. Look, you got a place here for your phone, electrical outlet, yep. USB, a cup holder, and look at all the space I have. That is amazing. And look, they, they did, I think, lower the doghouse, and that chair did look like it was very easy to swivel oh, around. it was. It was, definitely. This is great. And look at this up here. Yep. Oh, Ezra would love it there. Yep, but see, here's what I don't like. I, I feel like this does dip down some. You know, I, I did kind of like the flatness of the other ones. Yes. But it's all good. You know, and the steering wheel has been updated. You got your cruise control. You know, pretty nice. Wow. Let's get this AC blasting. Sorry, through. guys, we're hot. <laughs> I like it, though. I like that you have both seats swivel. You have a pedestal table goes there. Yep. You also have cabinetry up here. Under here. Nope. Oh, no, we don't. I guess it's for show. Okay, there's one. And you also have shades there in the front, guys. Yep. All right, we All got a right. bump over the cab. It holds 750 pounds. Love it. It's a great size bed, you guys. The highest weight in the industry. Yep. Very nice. Very nice. And I love how fast it goes up and down. Yes. Very nice, easy, and convenient. Oh, my. It is hot. It's hot out here. <laughs> cool. Over here, let's check out this living room area. All right, we have theater seating, everybody. As you can see the two seat belts, cup holders. Nice three cabinets up there. 
Let's check out these cabinets. Yeah, sorry about that. Very nice, very nice cabinetry. We do make these videos during business hours, so sometimes <laughs> I gotta answer. Matt, that. are you hot? Why, am I sweating? <laughs> cool, and then look at this, Andrea. Nice seats, recliners, oh my God. Very, very nice. nice. And there's the TV, you guys. Yep, I love it, I love it. Across from the sofa, or the uh, entertainment seating is the dinette. Yep, this dinette just dropped down to make a bed. With two you cup holders. You got seat belts on this side. Yep, cup holders. Nice window. Yep, I like very that. Very nice. Look, you got it. Privacy shade. Oh, hold on. Got it. Very nice. And you got your cabinetry. I not, do like the cabinets. Yep, not hidden hinge cabinetry, but again, price point motorhome. I really like that. You got a little something, something right here. And then again, uh, the TV, I like the placement of it and how it's and it does up. swivel if you guys can see yep. it's on an arm there so it will swivel yep andrea it's now time for the msrp burr, 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 burr. msrp on this motorhome is one hundred forty two thousand two hundred and fifty dollars msrp we have it 37 percent off wow because it's a 2020 it got to go down to 89995 wow. That is a phenomenal price. But Andrea, I might be able to get you a little bit better price than that. Try not, do or do not. <laughs> Andrea, tell everybody how they can do it. You can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962 or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or check out my website, mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV review sticker bing, right there. Also, there's a contact me page. Andrea, let's continue the video. Show everybody that kitchen. All right, everyone, here's the kitchen here. Nice cabinet here. Uh-huh. We got a window, mini blinds. We got the nice square sink. Oh, rectangle sink. I like square. it. Square. I said square. You, you did say me? square. It's the heat. You got a tower power. Here we go. I like these. We have three, oh, well, I do it every time. Sponges, and we got one big drawer here. We got a cabinet here. Very a nice. Trash can. We got another place for sponges. Nice. Interesting. Double sponges. Another drawer, and above we have our microwave. Great size. Uh huh. I like the backsplash. Yep. Three burner cooktop with the glass cover. Nice. We have the Furion stove. Totally. And where's the refrigerator? Right there. Oh. It's blended in. Well, hold on. Let's get this pantry. Very nice pantry. Another space there. I'm not a fan of the wooden color. I think I've said that before. So, oh, this is different. Okay. So, guys, I believe nice. this is. It's a big fridge. Two eight way? Yep, two two way fridge. Runs all both propane and electric. Nice. And here we have our panels here. Yep. Air and conditioning as you can see and everything. The thermostat and your yeah, inverter. as you can see how hot it is in it's here. It's very hot in here, guys. We, we do this for y'all. <laughs> we got a pocket door for the bathroom, which is yep. nice. Yep. Step into that nice shower. Look how big this shower is. Like it. I absolutely love it. I love the glass door. This is just nice. More importantly for me, I don't care about the doors. I care about the size, but I know Andrea likes that door. And also, guys, look at the medicine cabinet. That's nice. Yeah, for all your medicines. Open up. And then you got a another cabinet here with yep. shelves. Got a fan there, mm -hmm. a towel rack. And I mm -hmm. really, really like the fact that you have counter space here. Yep. There's a nice window here as well. Wow. And we got a towel holder. And then underneath, you have more space. Yep. Not a lot, but yep. all right, let's check out the toilet it's now time for the toilet test and it looks plastic uh-oh plastic wow 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 oh no here's the good news though it's low i like it i i like the placement listen this is not a prime pork a pooping position because it's plastic doesn't get the four p's but it is a good placement you know you swap this out with a porcelain toilet and i mean this is, holder, this is yeah. nice and again, I'm not mad that it's plastic, it is entry level, so. Okay. Cool. Oh, this is nice. Pocket door on the bedroom. Yep. We got a queen size bed. Yep. Last switch. Queen bed, that's kind of, oh man, boring bed. Interesting there. because they don't have a headboard. Yeah. We should have put a so headboard. So let's see the cabinets. 
Nice cabinetry. Okay. Yeah, very nice cabinets. I love the reading lights. Yep. I like that there's a window there, Matt. Yep. And I like that they kind of, they do give you like nightstands. Check this out. Uh -huh. And you have a cabinet underneath, which is nice. Um, hold on over here, Matt, I didn't, okay, here's the wardrobe. Close yes. that. Uh-huh. And then we got one big drawer underneath. This drawer. Wow. That is awesome. And then you got. Dang nabbit, y'all. The last minute of the, uh, last couple minutes of the video got distorted. So, uh, so yeah. Andrea, it's yeah. now time we give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what should we do first? Let's do three things we dislike about it. Okay. <laughs> My dislike was right here. I don't like how the coax is there and there's a door right there, y'all. Um, I don't like that. I wish they would just put the TV there instead of that door. Andrea, okay. what's your yeah. dislike? Oh, hi, Yuna. Uh, say hi. <laughs> um, I don't like the way that they put the TV there instead of that door. Um, I wish they would just put the TV there instead of that door. Andrea, what's your dislike? Oh, hi, Yuna. Say hi. Um, what I didn't like. It was the fridge. Yeah, the color of the but Andrea said she does not like the color of this refrigerator. She just rather have it yeah. stainless steel and I concur. And then three, the third dislike was, what was our third dislike, Andrea? Um. It had to be, oh, 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 I remember. It was the back, the headboard, the no headboard right there. Yeah. 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 It's really hard for me. Uh, I have a bad connection with you. Okay, so but but hang on. It, it's the it's the lack of headboard there. We wish there was a headboard, and yeah. So that's three things we didn't like about it. Uh, hang on, Andrea. You just eating soil, so you need to hurry up. Okay. Here. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. Andrea, first. What did you love about the motorhome? Ah, oh, on, Andrea loved the sofa. It was a recliner yes. sofa, and it was yes. an awesome feature and an awesome placement. So that's right. one. Two. Yeah, come here. No, no, no. I'm sorry. She's like getting into stuff. All right. Well, Andrea, we'll let you go. Say bye, bye everyone. Bye. <laughs> so two, I absolutely love this shower it is absolutely amazing i love the dip i love the width oh oh my god i love the depth i love the width it is just an incredible shower especially for such a small motorhome and then three the third thing we like about this motorhome well that we love about it i'm gonna say the new cockpit area well this is great and everything but really it's the improvement right here I absolutely love that. If you guys remember watching our old Integra Vision videos, I did not like, we, we never liked the uh, front computer tray on the Visions. And with this new chassis, they improved it. And I love that. Oh, and actually I'm gonna add one last thing. I absolutely love the fact that this motorhome has an outside kitchen. I absolutely love that. That's not a feature that you get on very many motorhomes. And it's awesome. Well, that's it, that's the video. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry that our video cut in and out. <sighs> Again, I don't know what's going on. After like nine minutes, the video cut out. So if anybody knows what's wrong uh, with, it's a GoPro Hero 8. Send me an email, mattsrvreviews at gmo.com so maybe I can get the problem fixed. But if you have any questions about this motorhome or any other motorhome, please call me, text me, send me an email. It is Matt's RV Reviews at gmail.com or my cell is 301-906-0962. I work for General RV of Ocala, Florida. And again, if you could leave down in the comments below, let us know the three things you love about this motorhome and the three things you didn't like about it. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.